Welcome to Greenlight the Day. Today I'm going to share with you um, something that I read in a greeting card, but actually reflects something that I really uh, believe in and is a guiding principle in my life. We cannot hold a torch to light another person's path without bri brightening our own. And to me what that says is um, if we go through life and, and make a conscious effort to make a positive impact in somebody's life, whether it's um, by smiling at a stranger that you're, you meet as you walk down the street, or with random acts of kindness. Um, you buy uh, a homeless person a meal, perhaps. Um, I, I one time was in a bus depot with my dad. He was catching the bus home. And there was a fellow there who obviously had hit some hard times, uh, maybe had some addictions issues. He was kind of unkept. Um, but he was going down the row of us sitting in the bus depot asking for money. And each person was saying no, myself and my dad included. And he went a couple of more people down and he um, asked a lady for some change. And she looked at him and said, I won't give you money. There was a restaurant in the bus stop, but if you're hungry, I'd be happy to take you into the restaurant and buy you a meal. And she did. She proceeded to buy him soup and a sandwich and whatever she bought him. And when she had done was done paying for that meal, she came out and sat back down beside us. And, and Dad said, you know, I would have never thought of that, but that, that was a good thing to do. I'll remember that. And... Um, her response was, I have a son, and I always imagine if my son was in that circumstance, if my son was alone and desperate and hungry somewhere, I pray that somebody would have the compassion to feed him. And that just so touched me. And so her shining a light or holding that torch up to, to light the path of this unfortunate man for a few minutes that day not only brightened his path and brightened her path but she brightened our path too and so I think about that often when I'm in a situation like that and I've actually done the same thing on occasion um, but I look for ways in which I can help somebody um, in a very uh, unobtrusive way in a selfless way without expecting any um, payback, remuneration, or recognition for that. Because for me, um, when I am blessed enough to have an opportunity to provide a random act of kindness like that to a stranger, it diminishes it for me. It diminishes the joy that I get from it if I actually share the specifics about that with too many people. And I may, I may tell my mom or there are a couple of people that I might share it with. But to me, it becomes less selfless the more you share what you did. Unless you're doing it as part of trying to um, help somebody else uh, find a way to perhaps lighten their day um, by helping another fellow uh, human being. And so today, and, and as many days as I can moving forward, that's how I'm going to green light my day, is by continuing to look for those opportunities when I can hold that torch for um, a fellow human being, uh, be it a friend or a stranger and hopefully lighten their load or um, light their path for a little bit. I hope that you have a great day. Bye now.